It's a concept that Lincoln and I started together. So we want to use uh, local sustainable fish, scientifically sustainable, uh, ethically caught and handled, and smoked using local timber. So we want to use all Australian products, um, local fish, and keep everything as local as we can to get control the product and, and get the best quality product we possibly can. The fact that we can trace it literally from the fishermen right to the plate. So the fish are caught locally by small small time fishermen. There's nothing trawled, we don't have any mass caught uh, fish. And you can, we can tell you the day it was caught. We get the fish usually within a few hours of capture. We can tell you the origin of the timber because we hand shave it ourselves, we collect it in the local area. If you wanna know the whole story from you know paddock to plate, from sea to surf, then we can tell it. The conception of it really started four and a half years ago or something like that. Um, it, it was a backyard idea um, and come through development, trying different things just for my own amusement at the time. It's still in development stage now. To say that we've finished developing is, it would be wrong. We, we change things nearly daily um, to, to keep improving. I've not seen or heard of any other people doing the same type of stuff, definitely not commercially. We kept that up with our entire product presentation, so we, we're the uh, only people in the world, as far as we know, that uh, commercially produce hot smoke thin slice fish. Essentially one of the reasons Luke and I sort of jumped into this was to be able to utilise the quality fish that are caught here and sort of uh, change the way the old guard has done it. Uh, the reason it's unique is, is Lincoln has developed a, his own smoker, a smoke generator that is unlike anything else on the market. So all the feedback we've had from butchers, from chefs, is that, wow, this is something that we can't do. Uh, you know, you guys are onto something big. At the moment on my menu I have their smoked... Uh, Spanish mackerel um, and currently on the menu it is on breakfast as an eggs benedict and then on the lunch menu as a salad. The Seafood Smokery boys their product is absolutely stunning. The quality of the product itself is basically second to none as far as I'm concerned and as far as what I've worked with in the past. When someone says that it's, it's fresh like you literally won't find it any fresher than you will find it here. Once they tasted it knowing that it wasn't the usual product from Tasmania they, they, they've never looked back. The name Bundaberg sells products, there's no doubt about it. Uh, just coming from the Bundaberg region, we're known as the, the food bowl of Australia. From a business perspective, from us, we're at the start of the barrier reef. We've got this gorgeous um, fish stock that, that really starts in Bundaberg. We've got a great local um, supply of fish. Uh, you want to talk about the, the business for macadamia, we use macadamia timber, well, we're in the macadamia capital locally. The, another reason Luke and I have looked looked at Bundaberg as a serious option when we did this was because of you can see the infrastructure and the uh, the development that has taken place particularly in the last few years has definitely improved the attractiveness of Bundaberg yes. We believe we've secured a almost statewide distributor uh, which is amazing for us moving forward. You can buy it through a range of outlets through the Sunshine Coast, Bundaberg, um, Harvey Bay, up to Yapoon, down into Brisbane. Soon you're going to be um, able to buy it from Cairns through to the Gold Coast and hoping to move into the southern states very soon.